Welcome back to the RV Rundown. This is the segment where we take a quick look at some of the hottest floor plans on the market today. I'm your host, Barry, and I'm standing inside a 2021 Venture Sport Trek Touring Edition 333 VMI. This is a front living travel trailer. So I'm standing what is in essentially the front cap. We have that automotive grade windshield that's letting all this light down into this living room. And guys, this feels like somebody squished a fifth wheel down into a travel trailer. It is an awesome layout. The living room itself has great amenities. We have a huge entertainment center that has loads of storage all the way around it a big old flat screen and that is on a swivel mount so we can pull it out. There's a fireplace down low that's going to aid in heating up this camper in cold times and save you some LP cost. If you do have guests, that's not a problem because this sofa folds out into a bed. Directly across from our entertainment center, we have theater seating and this is pretty special in the sense that it has heated seats and massaging seats that are also recliners and they've done some pretty cool stuff like incorporating some charging stations and cup holders into the center of it. No shortage of storage in here in the form of overhead cabinetry as well as all sorts of cabinetry in our kitchen as we push forward or backwards I should say into the camper. We come into this space where we have things like our pantry with adjustable shelving a 12 volt refrigerator that's very spacious and generous for this size of camper. All of our surfaces in here are solid surfaces, so all of our countertops are non-permeable, and that allows us to have plenty of prep space. This hutch holds our sink. Our sink itself has a large single basin stainless steel and again storage built all the way around it. As we push forward, we see that we have a freestanding dinette. So these actually incorporate a little bit of storage down into the chairs as well. Moving back, we come into the hallway where we pass our Go Power monitoring station, and that's because this has a solar panel up top that helps trickle charge the battery. The bathroom is very spacious. It has a nice large shower enclosure with skylight above, foot flush toilet, medicine cabinet, as well as some extra storage in the form of cabinetry on the wall. And also in the hallway we have our main control center and this has lots of great buttons that make everything super accessible and easy to use. The main bedroom is huge. Because the bed is on a slide it really opens up the floor space here. We have another electric fireplace that's built into all of this surround storage that we see here. Nice hanging closet on the side, as well as chest of drawers. There's even storage up under the bed. It lifts us on struts. And notice that we have power up top, so if we needed to hook up a CPAP or something along those lines, we could. And another thing that they've thought of here is that this has a space for a washer dryer. So we could hook up a combo unit there so you can clean your clothes. I think that's pretty slick. And before we get out of here, let's jump outside and check out the outside kitchen. Here outside the 333 VMI, we have this wonderful outside kitchen slash entertainment space. This is on the back side of the entertainment center that we saw in the living room. And they've built in a two burner stove as well as a sink, plenty of storage in the form of like cabinetry up above and drawers down below. We've got a decent little refrigerator as well as a spot to hook up a TV if we so choose to. Our LP connection is down below, which allows us to connect that two burner stove or even a grill to the main LP tanks on board. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this quick little tour of the 333 VMI. Until next time, happy camping.